Hello and welcome to Picture Astrology. In this quick video, we will learn about placement of Jupiter in the mysterious sign of Scorpio. And though Scorpio is considered to be a very friendly sign for Jupiter, many of the classics have ascribed certain pitfalls which must be taken care of. So in this video, we will see various impacts of this placement on your physical, mental and emotional well-being apart from those necessary precautions and one with very specific example I will also show how can you use a placement like this as the basic sutra or a basic seed in getting the holistic understanding of the chart. So let's begin with talking about physique or the impact of this placement on your body and this will be more pronounced obviously when this uh, combination anyways impacts your first house or ascendant or ascendant lord. Now generally this is known to give you a very robust and a broad physique, a person who has a, bo a broad body frame or rib cage. And the primary reason being that Jupiter is a big planet. It is a representative of fat in the body. And Mars or the Scorpio being the fixed watery sign and owned by a planet Mars and both Mars and Jupiter are pretty masculine planets and fat finds very conducive environment in a watery sign especially when it is fixed it doesn't give you know soft or a weak constitution but a very very robust one so obviously these guys would find gaining weight pretty easy and losing weight would be a difficult task and this would be the basic contribution of say Jupiter in Scorpio for your chart but then suppose there is an aspect of Saturn on this Jupiter now remember I am taking I am talking about aspect not Saturn being with the Jupiter Saturn being with the Jupiter would make Saturn also in a watery sign so that would have a slightly different impact but if Saturn has an aspect here and Saturn's aspect is actually opposite to what Jupiter does. Jupiter is the planet of expansion whereas Saturn is the planet of contraction. So if Saturn aspects as Jupiter it would provide or modify this in a certain way that the person will not have that great tendency to gain weight easily. Now um, physique as I always say is pretty much dependent on your first house or the lord of this house but in this case it will uh, the behavior of Mars or Jupiter will also be on the Mars because Mars is the lord of Jupiter sign so now consider say Mars also say present in a watery sign then obviously the weight issue will be more but say Mars is present in a fiery sign then you know that fire, the basic uh, nature of fire is transformation, transformation from one uh, stage to another. Fire can transform wood into ashes and smoke and that transformation can be quick and complete. So if in this case say Mars is in the fiery sign, then what it contributes it is a tendency where a person can easily gain weight and it finds also easy to lose weight if he does exercise by virtue of Mars being in a transformative sign but now suppose Mars was in an airy sign airy sign are the most hard to gain weight so suppose Mars is in the sign of Gemini now that person will have not that a great tendency to gain weight so that's how in this videos I'm explaining the basic sutra of every uh, placement like Jupiter in so, so and so sign and so on but the combined effect on your horoscope, on your personality will be because of all these factors. And as I said in the beginning, any placement of Jupiter, when you look at Jupiter in any sign, has a lot of benefic connotations, a lot of positive connotations because Jupiter is the planet of Purva Punyas or results of your good karmas of past life. But there are a couple of pitfalls which we will discuss a little later. But Jupiter in this sign, you know, uh, Jupiter loves water. Jupiter is also great friends with Mars. And Martian signs, be it Aries or Scorpio, are full of energy. The only difference with Scorpio is 
that the energy of Scorpio does not find expression in an explosive way like it does in Aries. But inherently, Scorpio is capable of great physical and mental endurance. So what this placement shows is Jupiter in the sign of Scorpio. Jupiter is the planet of knowledge, of wisdom. And depending upon the two houses where the sign of Sagittarius and Pisces are placed in your horoscope, in those areas, the person will definitely be slow, meaning not very quick to take action. He will think about those actions, will be very deliberate. A planet Jupiter which actually guides your higher wisdom, your thinking abilities, that placed in this uh, fixed watery sign makes a person very deliberate and also decisive. See, they will be slow and deliberate but yet very decisive because it is ruled by Mars. Mars is not a planet which likes dilly-dallying. Mars is decisive. But the great thing is when they are in this first two stage of being slow and getting, you know, thinking about it, deliberating, people around them won't even have a whiff of what they are trying to do. So basically there is a great hidden aspect in the way they act. So much so that it can surprise many people, even their friends and family, because of their sudden decisive actions. So the actions seem sudden, but they are not actually. They have been ruminating about them for long. You know, there is this saying which says, you know, always behave like a duck. A duck on the water looks absolutely, uh, you know, calm and composed from outside. But inside, her feet are moving and flapping with rigorous and great force. And that's, you know, somewhat kind of nature that this Jupiter in the sign of Scorpio imparts you. But just as we saw in terms of physique, we saw those different examples where how different factors can affect physique differently. Similarly, in this case, any impact on your moon will have a great deal to say about how you behave, how your emotional and psychological reactions in the world will be. And another important thing to notice, the strength out of say five different planets or combination affecting your physique or mental ability, the most prominent effect will be from the planet or combination which is strongest in the chart. Another thing because of the slow and deliberate nature, yet the, the energy of Mars is that if the horoscope is intellectually inclined, these people can actually expound new theories. They can come up with new logic, new explanation of various cosmic phenomena. And thus, this is a placement which is very conducive for researchers, for knowledge seekers, for even astrologers and all kind of occult activities. And another great thing about this placement which is always talked about is that these, this actually imparts a very good memory power. If, if you heard the phrase that water has memory and fixed water has much more memory. And the planet of uh, you know Jupiter which is connected with all kind of knowledge and how you expound it in this watery sign definitely gives someone who can recall things pretty easily. And in other words you can also say someone who doesn't forget anything <laughs> whether it be good or bad. Now let's talk about some of the difficulties. Now again if you see many of the classics they talk about two issues with this placement. One is regarding the health. And second, even though they would be slow, deliberate in their acts, they can sometimes hurt or harm others or the larger interests of society because of their acts. And the fundamental reason for that actually lies in the fact that Jupiter rules the ninth sign, um, the sign of Sagittarius. And Scorpio is a sign which comes right before Sagittarius, which in other words, you can say it is 12th from Sagittarius. Now what happens is any sign which is the 12th from it is considered very detrimental for that sign. So Scorpio being a sign one step before Sagittarius is not too conducive for the natural significations of the sign of Sagittarius. And among many things, you know, Sagittarius naturally the ninth sign is the sign of social good, of the social welfare, 
of larger welfare than your own and therefore jupiter here can can see remember that example of physique how things impact your physique something similar will apply here but it has the seed of being more self-centered than more concerned about others welfare and sagittarius is also many times associated with physical felicity with the robustness of your body and health so yes if jupiter and scorpio is associated with your ascendant and ascendant lord is well placed then definitely your body will look strong but if there is any affliction at least this jupiter and scorpio gives you a doubting tendency anything which happens to your physically you would be rushing towards doctor very soon kind of makes you worry a lot about your health that's another seed of this placement of jupiter in scorpio so friends this was my very quick analysis of jupiter in the scorpio sign we will definitely look at it in more details when we talk about every ascendant thank you for spending your time with me and i hope to see you again soon bye bye